Right, right, another uh, key shot, a quick tip. This one for rendering a mat ID pass um, for separating out your different materials to mask in Photoshop or wherever you're compositing. So basically, um, there's two ways to do this in Keyshot. You can do it manually using the, uh, the tune shaders here, or you can, if you're rendering, you can just add it in here as a clown pass. Essentially, it's going to do the same thing. The clown pass will it'll just output that which are render. Um, save it wherever you saved your render. Or you can do it manually here using these tune shaders. So I'm just going to drag this on here. And the first thing you'll notice, we're looking for a solid um, color. Uh, it's outlines on here by default. So right click and edit material or else material tab. Double click it here. So we'll edit that material. You can see here contour width. Just make sure to set that to zero. And that'll give us our solid color. Now you could drag out from here again and you know drag, drag, drag. Or we want it red wherever. I hope. Or not, yeah, I can't actually put it anywhere here, but with the other colors, let's say we drag blue on here, do the same thing here, but set the contour with the zero. If you drag this out again, to so say up here or here or wherever, you're gonna have to keep changing that. So, one thing you can do is right click on the material and uh, copy material, right click up here, and uh, you can just paste linked material. And you can see it, it's just, you know, any any changes we make here, so I'll set back to one. Sorry, any changes I make here, you can see it's made on both because they're essentially uh, instanced or linked materials. So, just something to bear in mind. So, we can just do the same here, drag our green in. It's already automatically come up here in the material editor, set that to zero. And we can right click, copy material, right click, um, and paste, paste link material, right click, paste link material. Um, and we can just grab our blue again, so we can copy material, paste link material. Sorry, I should have, um, I don't really did one of the teeth, so copy and paste link material so now that's essentially all we need for our mat id pass we render to sell our screen grab it into photoshop and then we have this as a mask that we can isolate the different materials and edit them over in photoshop so that's the two the two methods the clown pass and simple you just check check um over here in the passes tab all you do is check clown pass and it'll automatically output that pass for you wherever you save your render um, so either either and that's basically all there is to it alright cheers thanks good luck